Your expert has already verified that the fingerprints are Tony's and the handwriting is his. Oh, he checked it out, did he? Oh, yes. Well, there's no need to be so careful. Um, every danger owner, look, making me write this. Drive you in a car on a country road, shot at me. Start thinking. Forced off the road. Don't worry, I'm not hurt. That must be a relief when you got to that part. Oh, yes, indeed. Demand 300,000, whatever you do, don't turn. No police, sit tight. Your expert has told you, I'm sure, everything, including the text. Yeah, you know they did in his way, but... Uh... Also that the money will be available. Yeah, that was a lucky thing, wasn't it? Having that... And also uh, the fact that your being here jeopardizes my nephew's life. Now, supposing we were watched. Good point, sir. Absolutely right. Better run along. The one or two little things I have, I guess, uh, they can wait till, um, yeah. Pfft. Now, it's just hit me how much you must love those flowers. Now, when you didn't go straight to the bank, I mean, with your nephew being kidnapped and they told me you took the time to stop off at the nursery? You mean I'm being followed already? And you promised you wouldn't? I'm going to call up your superiors. No, there's no need to do that, sir. No. They've told me and they made it very clear. I'm to stay in touch, but until your nephew is released, believe me, we're way back, way back. Nothing to worry about. In that case, I don't mind revealing that my nephew is not worth a sack of peat moss. He's a wife-ridden weakling who I've despised for years. And if it wasn't for the fact that he's my only relative, I'd call up his captors and tell them that they're welcome to him.